Hi everybody, I'm Iron Psycho, and yes, we are back in two air memories of old. God, I'm just following him. It's it's amazing to think that these are adults. Oh, and I feel like my she's bigger than them. Ah, crap! I'm not paying attention. I keep looking at everything else. That was that sound. That was grass. But yeah, um, I really need to stop playing games back to back when I start losing the stuff that I want to say. Oh wait, hold on. The Twilight Guardian opened her eyes in the light of the sun and moon shining together. She sat down and calmly took both in her both in her sky hands, bringing balance to light and shadow. With her right. And she released the sun and let people back it from the dream. With her left hand, she flings the moon into the night. Flings? That's rude. Sky, so people may dream at all. She is the heartbeat of the seasons in the center of the world. The breath of life and order. I love how video games try to push the idea that women are the goddesses or the creators of the realms and stuff. Oh, these should have been things. And I say this because it's amazing how intent they are. I guess I could just jump down here. About how it is and how they want it to be, but we still have that problem in real life. And how they don't believe themselves to be the right to- wow. It's a lot of contributions. To which I kind of don't want to care about at the moment because one, my brain is slowly already well fuck you because oh, I take a nap and I should probably eat more. You know. Oh, it's the fish. Why am I picking up dirt in the pond? What is that? Oh my god, this temple's huge! Oh my gosh. Alright. I dig it. Gotta love it. I'm feeling for it. One step at a time. There's no need to fight. Where the hell am I going? This place is humongous. There's a key I need to find. One step at a time. Oh my gosh. Oh, hold on. Let me unlock this first before I keep going up again. Use. Yeah, I thought so. Let me go up here first because I want to see what they're saying. Or what they're see what they're doing, for that matter. Did people actually, like, live here? There's someone up there. Starting the fires. They used to have a bridge, clearly. How long ago was this? Oh, I can hear them. Man has paws that cannot run, but chases longingly the sun. Man has wings that cannot fly. I do. But he will always seek the sky. Man has eyes that cannot see, but watch eternity. Man is lost unknowingly in danger. To his mind, always a stranger. Oh, wait, hold on. Cause that looks like that's the right way. I could also honestly be going the correct way this entire time. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Oh my god, I haven't abused people with that sound in such a long time. I feel bad because I'm pretty sure she fam's on the phone trying to do important stuff and I'm just like, I know I'm not doing it right, by the way, for good 
reasonable purposes the fact that I don't want to be bombarding sounds such a good such a good thing though that's like these were supposed to fall but time just stagnated and things led to what they were God, it's hard to tell if I'm going the way I'm supposed to or oh lo lost your head Here's the moon. Read part two. Help them. The other animals look stunned. Yes, the fox said. Their minds see eternity. They're lost and afraid. They need something to hold on to, or they will harm themselves. The lands and us, the fox said. What do you propose? asked the hare. <gasps> I propose a pact, said the fox. If one of them can talk to us, we offer him the bond of the land. The fox continued, if he accepts, then he can take the shape of one of us, and the the one he made the pact with. So can someone turn into a fox? I can turn into a bird, and he will be the one with the land, and still see beyond the veil, and he can guide and guard his people, and so we will all be at peace, said the fox. The other man almost saw the wisdom in this, and agreed to it. And so some humans who became one with the world, and the chosen were called whispers. This part, wah! Hold on, I read it wrong. When the world was still new, and the creator had the dawn and the lens of spirits gathered together to talk. The fox said, "There are many. There are new animals around. They walk on two feet." A crane said, "A new bird." The fox shook its head and said, "They have no wings." The monkey said, "I have seen them too. They are without fur and they cannot climb well." Said, and an owl said, "They." Fear the night and drive it away with fire. The otter said they build nests on the land, but when they are, but they are not one with it. A deer said, they are loud and do not know how to walk the woods. The bear said they are like cubs who do not know the way home. The fox crooked its neck said, yes, this is why we have to help them. What broke? Oh God. Okay, I'm just gonna follow the right my right side of the wall until I can get somewhere what? this place is humongous Oh, I get it. Ha 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 ha. Oh my god, and those lead to other things too. Do I even want to use that one? I want to use it because I want to touch it. But other than that. To think my messing around would lead to just working out the puzzle anyways. Because I am genius. I am genius. Alright. Does this lead anywhere that I need to hate myself for? Nope. Oh, thank god. It's been nine minutes. And I still need to go this way. Oh, I don't. Oh, thank goodness. There's the light. Oh, what's this? Power up. That one was easy. Thank goodness. I mean, they wanted to be straightforward anyways, right? Nope. There we go. Oh no. But what's that? That's the other issue I have. What did that lead to? And what did that lead to? 
Oh, great. Hold on. I'm gonna undo this really quick. Did I miss stuff? I missed stuff, didn't I? I really hope I didn't. I missed stuff. I missed whatever that was. Shoot. Oh no. Isn't that important? It's lit. I still haven't gone up the other way either. Oh, I was doing the right thing. I mean, I should have known better, but to think that it won't let me go back at all. Oh, can I cheat? Yes, I can. Well, not cheat, but you know what I mean. Wait, what? Oh my god, why? Alright, hold on. Go here first. Oh, crap. Oh! Oh, never mind. Oh. Guntabad. It seems the door has been stuck for a long time. Wonder if there's anything on the other side. Por qué? What was the point of all that? Oh, apparently I didn't miss a beat. I didn't miss anything. Oh. I am Kara of the Thunder Islands. Kara. I am Kara of the Thunder Islands. I have... I had a strange dream that I will record here so that others may perhaps understand its meaning as I did. I had come to study the holy carvings in the lighthouse, and the land gods trying to understand her heritage. As I reached out, <laughs> as I reached out to touch some of the ruins, it suddenly felt as if a warm hand pressed over my eyes and I fell asleep on the sacred stone. In my dream, it seemed to me that the stone beneath me glowed from within, within forming a staircase up into the starry sky. Far away on these steps, a golden light grew and drew close. Stars flew from the sky and became someone who had the shape of music and was gentle and sad. The god spoke to me, and not in words, but in memories and feelings. He warned me of a terrible greed from beyond a void in the hearts of men. As he showed it to me, I felt it stir and come between us darkness, the golden of steps like a storm cloud, cold as eternity. Terrified, I cried out as I pulled out the dark void and I woke. I could not speak for three days, but it sent out an ancient temples immediately. If what I have seen is true, the gods are alive and they need our help, as we need theirs. Are these the steps that I need to take? Oh no, yeah, it's... Wow, I went that way and it took me all the way along that way? Cool. I'll go this way, go this way... I'm so glad I decided to take a break from the temple. If this was what was gonna happen. Well, I didn't take a break, I paused and decided to continue on. Um... I'm just gonna undo it anyways, because I'm pretty sure it's important. Oh no. Wonders. I have to find four more. Three more, sorry. Four total, three more. Um... Okay. 
after one day. Oh, what's that? But yeah, it's just there's so much going on. Oh, <gasps> bro, not a chance. It's dead. Oh. Well, this would have been a much easier way to go through, right? Maybe. I'll have to do it again. Great. That's what I get for being curious. Killed the cat. Oh, yeah. Just kidding. Oh. There's another way to get up there. She doesn't jump high or far enough for it to be accessible the way that I want it to be. Never mind, I was right, there are four more. Oh, it's smart even before I realized how smart I was. Get to bed. That's not fair, I could clearly should be able to do that. Hold on, I'm getting up there. Um, I don't know. Man. I, I'm not, to be completely honest with you guys, I'm not entirely excited for leaving out of town. Um, with good reason, and it's because, one, I'm gonna be on a flight going to Ohio, which hits Houston first, and if you guys haven't already known, Houston is currently such a hot spot that the hospitals are full. Like, San Antonio, Austin, Houston, and Dallas, they're all... Oof. They're all, the hospitals are full there. They're max capacity and they're using other places in order to deal with the influx of COVID patients. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Maybe I'm going to do, you know, no, I'm going to do my best to stay safe because I need to think about myself and yes, about those around me, but being sure about my own safety means that I'm protecting others as well, because I'm going to be wearing the mask. I don't know if I'm going to be wearing gloves. I'll probably have that small little sanitizer. And you may think like, oh my god, you're so scared of it. Like, it's not... It's not exactly being scared. It'll suck. It'll be a... To... The hell is that? It'll be a hell of a thing to, to get it. That's the only reason why I don't want to catch it. I'll continue my thought process right now. Hold on. Come here, little bird. A very long time ago, your people dressed me as the Twilight Guardian. Sitting at the board of Dusk and Dawn, ensuring safe travel on the path of the land of dreams and back again. Even after the Great Divide, I was there, watching as your princess Kara led their people to safe shores here in my temple. A long time here, here I have waited for this moment to come. I have grown weak, but for the power I was then teethering me to the old world. Listen carefully, little bird. Once again, the void has awakened with that greater hunger. It's time to devour all that is left in the world. But there is still a chance to stop him. The priestess Scar had hidden three fragments of gate power in one of each temple. You have to make the three fragments once again. I will give you a part I was given for safekeeping. Without it, I will flee into oblivion. He has been my link to this world since the time the gods were lost to the Knights of Men. But we cannot wait. Please, accept my fragment. Frag, frag, I said that wrong. Please accept my fragment and finish what was started so long ago. Rest well, my dude. That's not a fragment. That's a piece. Aww. Rest well, dude. Still bigger than me. Oh. Oh, it's becoming one with me. That's cool. Oh, it's so much like, uh... Hey, bro. It's so much like Twilight Princess. And that's Ganon. 
Like, he is the Void who wanted to destroy- take over the world, though. To think. Uh, that was the right way, but I was going the completely correct way the entire time. 20 minutes, nice. But yeah, it's it's not a fear of it. Like, oh my god, everything... It's to be wary about. It's to be smart about it. It's something that people need to think about, or at least consider, because at least New Zealand was able to get eradicated from their lands. That's how, that's how possible it is for us to overcome the situation that we're currently facing. Because it can be eradicated. I am, I am your whole of the Southern Isles. This is my third and final record of my travels in the Land of Gods. I happened upon the fox just as I was about to leave for home. He sat in the middle of the road and seemed to, la to laugh slightly, as if some hidden joke. I spoke in anger, anger. My people are dying! Why is this happening? He smiled. His smile seemed sad. The darkness within called to the darkness without. Heal your people to be healed. This is not your path, Yoho. I did not know what to say and stared at him as he left. Later I realized uh, he was right. It was not my path, but one for ho my whole people. As I passed the twilight lake, I met with Kara for the first time. I met with Kara for the first time. She showed me the advertised sanctuary and asked me to gather the people I knew. This is the refugee we all hope for. I will journey home again and I will guide my people here. I will see my only child, Rhea, again. And I will bring her home. Gorgeous. Who is that? There's the black rocks, though. Curiosity has caught at me, as it always has. Alright, yeah. Uh, the river has fallen. What are the spirit fish? Is she alive? Oh, this used to be a river. Oh. Holy crack. We're missing that one then? Ah, here's something. That self proclaimed god reaches too far. I hope he stretches himself too thin. The crane? Wait, hold on. Wow. Wow, I'm missing this side then. There's the lighthouse. I can probably travel that way. And yes, I'm gonna sadly continue recording because, like. Look how gorgeous this is, guys. Um, something be worried about. It does have extremely high cases. It won't scare me as badly as, um, a zombie virus. That's gonna be, like, the pinnacle of what scares the bejesus out of me, to be honest with you. Oh, what's that? Oh, I love it. Oh, this is such a cute little egg. <laughs> oh, did I read this one? Did I go there? In the beginning, there was the dreamer, asleep in cold eternity. She dreamed all there is. Oh, not space. She dreamed a veil, the pie in the veil. She dreamed the crater and the world, all of her. 
Model from a memory of home. The creator danced in the world, and there he breathed the clouds and sang the sun and moon and being. As he danced between the clouds, he took four steps and so made the lands of the north, east, south, and west. Then he formed the mountains and filled the seas with water, and the clouds and the earth and the water he made the animals the land and sea could be alive. From the stardust and eternity he made the gods to walk the lands and look after the world. Then what's he called? Oh, creator. He's called the creator, and then there's the gods. Oh yeah, I was here last time. I have been here. Go south, there's a tree. She's just drawing all of this whenever she has the chance. Okay, yeah. Whoopsie. And then I was passing through here to where I find found Leafla. <gasps> Leafla is a female, my bad. Curiosity is tricking me. Oh, because it's the other way of flying. Right. Oh, I should have taken that when I had the chance. My bad. God. I can't... I, I would be amazed to see this game remastered. Because I think it would look phenomenal with like Unity Engine or with, um, oh, yep, that's the crane. When the engine's used to like make things look so, so realistic. I don't remember this place being here. Are the lands drifting in the wind? We need to hurry if we wanna, want to reach some place safe. Oh, it's the shape of a moon. I'm more curious about the middle area than I am about those edges right now. What? Oh. Because something struck. There is nothing more we can do. The machine is is an accident waiting to happen. We were too greedy. Oh, they tried to build something. Wait, hold on. I missed a person. Missed you. Do you have anything to say or are you dead? Oh, you flew. <laughs> Why, was this whole area one whole thing until you guys decided to try to make a machine? There's pieces all over the place. Wow. It's gorgeous. As well, though. Yeah, there's another dead animal. What is this? Let's start from that side. There are foxes. What did they do? Oh, there's a battle? Hello, excuse me, don't mind me. Curious about the battles that took place here. Oh, he got stabbed. He got run through. Ah. Oh. To Gorion and the Storm Islands. To Gorion and the Storm Islands. From his son, Tauza, father. It's with sorrow that I must tell you the loss of the Snow Crane Library. The palace guard of the city of On came in the night. Ooh. 
carrying weapons and shouting in the name of the king of Kuroku. I just think it's cool having a bunch of accents. They destroyed and burned houses and schools alike. They have word of burned us too, had we not been able to escape. We watched from a safe distance, keeping close to the few precious scrolls we had saved. Hey, clearly didn't burn those. These two. We will journey to a monastery in the northwest. The palace and the scrolls it is safe in its safety. I trust that's not too far away from Kuroku's wrath. And too poor to excite his greed. The spirit crane will guide, lead us into the snow lane and then return us south. With my letter to you, I hope he finds you well. I don't know if it'll find him well. It's in three parts. What time am I at? 30? Oh, great. <laughs> oh. Who are you fighting against? Man, you're ready to get that guy charged at you. Mayor, open the door. Are you just going to let the soldiers overrun your city? Stop carrying and come on out. Oh, there's more. Did I see these? A vast G. Aww, the soldiers came to. Oh my. Sorry, that scared me. Knock, knock, mare, come out. Probably already dead. <laughs> That's a really sad thing to think about, but it's also really funny. Why won't you come on out? Like, doesn't look outside. Hi! You're so noisy. Is there something important there? Those things have been pretty good guides, too, though. Ah! I have not a good guide, apparently. Curiosity has gotten a hold of me, yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's some scenes here I'm actually really curious about. God, there's just so much fighting. a lot over here. All the fighting is going around. The king demands ch changes. By royal decree of God King Yeah. By royal decree of God King Goroku, the king of the kings and god of gods all must bow to him and the god only god. His and his alone are all the lands of the east and lands of the gods. Bend to the knee and be spirit resistant. See the later of your last of your days. Such is the will of the king, god King Kuroku, now and forever, written in the tenth year of the Heron in his great city of On. I mean, if you kill him, he can't be considered a god, right? What's this? Dead. Crying. Broken building. No! Running. <laughs> Come at me, bro. That's not what it is. Sadly, that's not what it is. Is this, it looks like it was killed. Oh my gosh. 
I don't know if I'm being shouted at, that's the reason why I have this on the side really quick. Yeah, there's a... I can't remember the name of it, but it... It's about how the world was taken over by the sea or something like that. So you're just playing as these two orphan kids, um, cause the dad didn't- I don't remember if the dad died of the sickness or he didn't come back one day trying to look for food. But, um, you're playing as these two kids who have been living- who have just been traveling on a fisherman's boat because they were fishermen, that's what they did. That's how they survived. But the waters kept rising, um, a lot of things just kept happening, and it was- ugh, I'm trying to remember, hold on. And I should probably end it here because I'm already at 35, 36 minutes. But the idea was that- an, oh. oh, no, I thought that was a cave. A new world had just overcome the old one. And you're just traveling between ships. And the thing is, is that um, her brother, like, the main character's brother, ended up getting sick as well. So, oh my god, I didn't realize I was dead there. And, um... You were traveling between the different dissoluted buildings because... You were looking for stuff to either, like, help them, like, food or bandages or all this other stuff in order to help your brother. But in the background of all of it, you were seeing these creatures that looked very humanoid and were slowly turning- that slowly looked like... You- but, um, I think another thing happened too, like, you were slowly turning into one of those creatures as well. And I just- I, it's been such a long time. I love that game. The story for it was phenomenal to me. So, our scouts report that several deposits of air have been found under the temple grounds north of here. And it's just one of the, I don't know what it is. I think it's just story based games or that the world itself just tells you a story that get that just gets me for some weird reason. I'm almost about done with this by the way. Uh, again, I need to call it because it's already at a good amount of time, especially since I'm not cutting these because I feel like every piece of the world is important. Um Thank you guys so much for joining me. Like, share, subscribe. Let me know how you feel in the comments below because without a doubt, I want to finish this one through. And it doesn't look like it's going to take too much time to get through. The guard tower has fallen. Help me search for survivors. And it, I just, I can't. I can't think about a lot right now because I'm distracted. But it tells such a beautiful story to know that these things happen. It's not a beautiful story. The world freaking crumbled, I swear. Oh, yeah, there's the next one. But for right now, I'm going to stop it right around here. Alright. Until then, I hope to take flight with you in another episode, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.